right, so the next thing we want to do is how to bring in B-rolls into the timeline to make our editing look much more professional and better. Okay, so to bring in B-roll, you can just signify or identify where you want to bring in that B-roll. You can just go all the way up here. You can drag and drop it, select a clip, drag and drop it, and it's just as easy as you see. So you can decide to move across to see a preview of what you have here. You can just move across. I may not want to take, I want to take at this point, for example, I want to create a cut at this point. You can just select it and do command B to create a cut. And then I want to move up to this point. I may create another command B, but I want it to cut from here. Or you can come and trim from the edges directly, uh, just like so. Okay, so I want to delete this, select this and delete. And I just want to create this as a, a bureau uh, from this point to this point and then back to the video. So, and then we, we can bring in as many as we can. You can select this, drag and drop, like I've explained earlier. You can do the trim, you can trim across to any point of your choice. So, this one also the same way goes back. And you can do the same with other videos as well. So, for example, this one, you can drag and drop this one also. And you can zoom in and out from here, okay, like I've explained earlier. So you can zoom in and out to see the entire clip. And you may decide to create a cut from here, command B, cut from here, command B. And then I may want to delete this and delete this. And you can go ahead and move your B-roll to any location. And you can see right now it is connected to this. So when you move this, everything is moved together. Everything moves with it together. Okay, so you can see this small sign that it's connected, it's linked to this main clip on the timeline. Okay, so this is how to bring in B-rolls. You can do that the same with images. You can drag and drop images. You may want to extend to fill up any space of your choice. You can extend or reduce as you so wish by just coming to the edge and dragging and moving around to fill up the spaces that you want. The same way, you want to bring in this one and you want to extend or you want to extend the timing. You can do that very easily you can extend the timing across and then you can have you can continue to add any bureau to make your video look much more professional and nice you can bring in any amount of any number of bureaus and you can see this one is specifically connected to this so if i move it's going to move with that so you can select it and move it to any location like i've explained you can to adjust and change the location. But this is basically how to bring in B-rolls and do some bas very basic editings to make it fit and look professional on your timeline and in your video clip. So that does it for this tutorial. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.